Welcome to the Freddy Fazbear Virtual Experience. Fazbear Entertainment is excited to join the digital age, and what better way to do that than with an edge-of-your-seat virtual reality experience? We know that Fazbear Entertainment has developed something of a bad reputation over the last few decades, and while it's true that some stories associated with our name were loosely based on actual events, the majority of them were total fabrications from the mind of a complete lunatic. Lawsuits pending. But we aren't above laughing at ourselves. Ha ha ha. That's why we have recreated many of these completely fictitious scenarios, lies, that you've been fed over the last several years into a hilarious VR game, in the hopes that we can finally move past these childish ghost stories and develop a new relationship with you, as well as your kids. Don't forget the merch perfect for birthdays, so sit back and enjoy a few scares. We do, however, ask that you agree to a simple waiver before you play. It's mostly just legal mumbo jumbo and isn't at all based on user experiences thus far or in. You acknowledge that Fazbear Entertainment is not responsible for accidental digital consciousness transference, real world manifestations of digital characters, nightmares, night terrors, night sweats.
Hey, glad you came back for another night. I promise it'll be a lot more interesting this time. We found some, some great new relics over the weekend, and we're out tracking down a new lead right now. So, uh, let me just update you real quick, then you can get to work. Like, the attraction opens in like a week, so we have to make sure everything works and nothing catches on fire. Uh, when the place opens, people will come in at the opposite end of the building and work their way toward you and pass you out the exit. Uh, yeah, you've officially become part of the attraction. Uh, you'll be starring as a security guard. So not only will you be monitoring the people on the camera as they pass through, you know, to make sure no one steals anything or makes out in the corner, but you'll also be a part of the show. It'll make you feel really authentic, I think. Uh, now let me tell you about what's new. We found another set of drawings, always nice, and the foxy head could be authentic, then again it might Hello? just be another crappy cosplay. And we found a desk fan, very old school, metal though. Watch the fingers. Uh, <laughs> uh, right now the place is basically just, you know, flashing lights and spooky props. Uh, I honestly thought we'd have more by now. Uh, we don't have something really cool by next week, so we may have to suit you up in a furry suit and make you walk around saying, boo. <laughs> uh, but you know, like I said, we're trying to track down a good lead right now. Uh, some guy who helped design one of the buildings says it was like an extra room that got boarded up or something like that. So we're going to take a peek and see what we can find. Uh, for now, just get comfortable with the new setup. Um, you can check the security cameras over to your right with the click of that blue button. Uh, you can toggle between the hall cams and the vent cams. Uh, then over to your, your maintenance panel. You know, use this to reboot systems that may go offline. <laughs> so in trying to make the place feel vintage, we may have overdone it a bit. <laughs> Some of this equipment is barely functional. Yeah, I wasn't joking about the fire. That's, that's, that's a real risk. The most important thing you want to watch for is the ventilation. Look, this place will give you the spooks, man. And if you let that ventilation go offline, then you'll start seeing some crazy stuff, man. Keep that air flowing. Okay, keep an eye on things. We'll try to have something new for you tomorrow night. Welcome to Vent Repair. Fazbear Entertainment prides itself on having the most comfortable facilities. 
each facility is set to a perfect 72 degrees all the time. The four active indicator lights mean we have a well-functioning ventilation system. Your headlamp should protect you from any critters who may have stumbled into the ducts. As a certified vent technician, you should need no instruction. However, in case of an emergency, it is important to remember that as the vent technician, you should never, under any circumstances, attempt to Perfect 72 degrees. Good job. See you next time.
Welcome to Circus Babies Entertainment and Rental. It has been zero days since last incident. Emergency ventilation repairs may be necessary to reach the boiler room on sub-basement G. We apologize for the claustrophobic accommodations of the secondary service elevator, but the comfort of the main elevator. Now, let's get to work. Motion trigger. Breaker room. Well done. Well done. Well done. Motion trigger. Secondary service elevator ventilation shaft. <laughs> 